Hi friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. In today's video, I decided that it is about time that I give this space a redo, a makeover, a refresh. And this area is what I want to call my bar area. And it is on top of this credenza, one of two that I have flanking the sides of my fireplace. So we're going to go ahead Get this refresh, redo, makeover started, and hopefully I will incite you and enlighten you as well as influence you to make a little change in your space as well. So let's first talk about the vibe that I would like this space to exude. I want this space to be very lively. I want this space to be welcoming because it is where we have all of our libations. So I do want to possibly have some type of floral element and we're going to take away some things, add some things. And of course, we're going to have a space for some of our bar items. So I specifically want this to be served as like my bar cart underneath is where you will find all the spirits as well as the coordinating glassware. So I'm going to go ahead and begin removing some of the items, well actually all of the items that are on this um, credenza and we're going to go ahead and give it a really good wipe down with some glass cleaner and you know I always use that wrapping paper that they give you in the stores when you're you purchase something fragile don't throw that away keep that and use that to wipe off any of your glassware your mirrors anything like that it is perfect for those types of items so one area that I want to specifically work on is the area that will house all of my bar wear. And so I received the set of three, a three piece rustic wooden serving tray decorative set from Artful Works. Now these trays are very light and they have the gold um, handles, which you know goes with my decor very easily. And what I like about these trays is that you receive three and that you can use them in a multitude of ways. So I am going to take the largest of the trays as you can see here and it is easy to carry at the bottom it has the foot so you won't scratch your surfaces it is very like as I stated and so I'm going to use this as where I want to house and um, display some of my glasswares so um, these trays are great to use in a multitude of ways as I stated before and I'm going to share with you several ways that I am going to use these trays in my everyday life as well as decorating. So you will see here I've added my glassware and then I am going to add my ice bucket here. The ice bucket was all something I already had and I added my marble and gold trim coasters and everything that you're going to see on here is comprised of things that I already had so make sure you know all the time you don't have to run out and purchase something I know you have great things in your arsenal so I have a gold ice scoop and then those little rocks there those are your beverage rocks you put them in the um, freezer they get cold and you put them in your wine or your bourbon to keep them chilled instead of using ice that will water down your beverage. So this area here, um, like I said, I have it kind of counterclockwise because I want to maximize the space on this credenza, but I want to make sure that I put only the things that I needed at hand's reach there. So I have this 
um, orchid um, arrangement that I created a couple of years ago. I still have it, still love it, and I have it flanked on one side. I'm going to add my beverage shaker here that's also in a co coordinating shade of gold. And as you see, this tray is a relatively nice size. It's not too big where it takes up too much space and it makes it cumbersome to kind of carry things. It's just really a great way to display these items that I'm sharing with you right here so then I have my Voss waters I'm gonna put these on the side here just in case anyone would like these waters now you can get these at any of our local stores TJ Maxx home goods whatever you need you can pick those up there and they're great to have personalized waters for your guests to utilize should they feel um, the need to get something And then I decided that I wanted to add these three candlesticks here in coordinated sizes as well as this um, gold sign that says wine. And then I added these um, LED candlesticks that came from the Dollar Tree. Perfect size for this. I like the, how the heights, the various heights looks on this credenza. And then I think we're ready to go to the next display. I'm using this tray to house my candles in my bathroom. You will see all about this in an upcoming video. And then the last display is how I am using this tray with handles to carry my popcorn. I'm sitting here watching the game. And then here comes Oliver and that is it these trays are really great quality you can use them in a multitude of ways as i'm sharing with you and guys um it's great for a movie night take it outside um you can have your beverages on here especially now that we're headed outside again we can carry our beverages to our guests out on the patio you can have it on the patio and have all of your desserts in on them or you can use it as like um, a tray and house your remotes and things like that on your table um, you can use the trays to showcase your jewelry as well as your perfumes or you can also use them to kind of corral all of your sunglasses if you have a huge selection uh, collection like i do these will be great now they are made of um Japanese princess tree and it's the most sustainable and eco-friendly wood on earth so like I said they are very lightweight you can wipe them off they clean easily and they look absolutely beautiful they will go great with any design farmhouse modern glam they will fit in perfectly so guys I'm gonna leave all the details down below for you to go and take a look at this um, these trays and you get a set of three like I said and the price is very very economical and I want to thank Art for Works for working with me and share and showcasing these trays to you guys so if you like this video please give me a thumbs up if you're new to Wani's house I would love for you to subscribe so go ahead hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads also come on over and check them out on my Instagram Instagram. You can find me over there at Wani's house just like it is here. Hit that follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. Also check out my blog as well as my Amazon store that are both located down in the description box below. All right guys I'm about to go but before I do you know what I always say. The next time you're in town you can always stop by Wani's house and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.